Hello everybody. Now here's a strange little one on Design Spark Mechanical and it's to do with the dimensioning fonts. Uh, Design Spark people seem to be building a little secret uh, puzzles for us to solve. Uh, how do you change the fonts on the dimensioning text? Here's how to do it. But first here is a message. I have now created a Patreon channel. Your patronage will ensure that new and interesting tutorials on many other applications will be available. It will also enable me to employ other personnel that will free up more time to devote to the creation of tutorials. Some immediate tutorials will be on applications such as Autodesk products, AutoSketch 9, AutoCAD etc. Vectric products, VCAR Pro. It is also my intention to make tutorials on hand coding G-code for CNC machine work. Lathe work, milling and even aluminium casting will also be covered occasionally. Help and problem solving given and your suggestions for other tutorials would be welcomed. Please go to this address and become a patron. Thank you. Okay, we've got a rectangle with, an, with a hexagon in the middle and we're going to choose the dimensioning tool over here. The rectangle is 40 millimeters by 40 millimeters and the rectangle has got a side of 5.774. Now you see these, oh, might as well put that over there. <coughs> these dimensions are rather fat and I'm not keen on them. So I suppose we want to change them. We would think we could highlight it. That doesn't seem to do it. it. puts it in a box. Anyway, right click on it. Oh, right, here we go. We've got the font called Distant Galaxy. So, perhaps we want a more sophisticated font. Uh, <coughs> usually, Arial is... Pretty standard. If we can find the thing. There we are, Ariel. Ariel Black. Uh, uh, standard Ariel. Nothing's happened. Still highlighted, but it's still the old distant galaxy. However, if we perform a Control A, I'm going to do it now. Control A. We see that nothing much has happened, but if anything, nothing has happened. Control A is the standard Microsoft Windows select all action. Now, if we right click on it, we again get the mini toolbar up here. Change that to Ariel, if we can get there. There we are, Ariel. And look at that, it's changed. And we can ch also change the font size, right there, 1.8, 10, we Back to 1.3. So by doing a Control A, seems to enable the change in the font but you cannot see any effect of the control here. That is an, uh, a neat little mystery of building the design spark mechanical, it would seem. Anyway, I hope it is of use to somebody or other. Uh, if anybody wants to change the font for some artistic reasons, then that's how to do it. Hope you enjoyed that. Bye for now. Bye.